So Tina Rennie is asking, what about the 10% of MSs whose MRI shows no lesions? This is a terrific question. Um, I don't know the answer to this, and I don't think anybody does. Um, I think people will give you a lot of answers, and I think sometimes people are just confabulating and speaking for the sake of speaking. So I don't, I really don't know the answer. But there's two. This that brings up two interesting issues. As you know, people with primary progressive MS, which is possibly up to 15% of patients, don't have the classic, certainly on MR, lesions that you see in the majority of patients. And then even the classic, if you, there is such a thing as a classic MS patient, the relapse remitting patient, there's a lot of brain tissue that looks normal on the scans. Um, my instinct is that remyelination would be helpful in all phases of disease and in the progressive phase as well as the primary. But the hard experimental evidence to support that I don't think is out there. And if it is, I just don't know it. In which case, Tina can educate me. <laughs>